Police are searching for a man accused of sexually assaulting a woman on the hike and bike trail near Rainy Street. This attack could be related to another one that happened just two miles away last month. Stephanie. Amanda, police say this latest attack happened early Friday morning around 545. They say the suspect was running through this area. That's when he was last seen with no shirt, no shoes, just a pair of blue jeans. Now police are asking for your help in tracking him down. If you take a look at this map, they say the woman was sexually assaulted along the hike and bike trail near East Avenue and Cummings Street. Another jogger reportedly heard the woman scream and was able to stop the attack. The sex crimes unit is now looking into whether the suspect is connected to another attack that happened on August 22nd. A woman reported being grabbed from behind while jogging at Austin High School around 5 in the morning, but luckily she was able to get away. Police say they purposely waited a few days to release the information about Friday morning's attack, leaving some to wonder why. One expert we spoke with says notifying the community right away could harm the investigation. For people to know that this has happened, um, I don't want to find out once he gets caught after he's attacked three other women. I want to prevent any further incidents from, from happening. Yeah, I know that there are bike cops that come around here during the daytime, but um, I would hope that they would take you know, extra precaution during uh, a time like this and, and patrol the area more. Yell, scream, fight back, do whatever you need to do. Keep a self-defense item with you, so something like pepper spray a knife, but something that you're comfortable with using as well. The suspect is described as a white or Hispanic man who stands 5'10 to 6 feet tall, weighs about 215 to 250 pounds. He has short, somewhat messy hair, again, last seen wearing blue jeans, but no shirt or shoes. Like I mentioned earlier, police say the incident happened around 545 in the morning. It's still pitch black at that time, so police are really urging people, if you're going to run that early in the morning, make sure you have someone with you and also carry some type of light with you so you can see your surroundings. Back to you in the studio. Jacqueline Sarkeesian in downtown Austin. Jacqueline, thank you.